Okay, so this is a very short update, but I want to let you guys know what's going on right now. So yeah, it's been a while since I've done these, so let's get on with it. Here's the mid-month update for July of 2024. Blistering turmoil. Due to the blistering heat, my time on my laptops are basically limited. So I'm going to keep this update as short as possible, so that way you guys will know what's going on. Before we continue, the watch time for July shows like this. Almost 80% of my watch time comes from non-subscribers. Think we can improve on that? If you enjoyed the video, please be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe, and click the bell. Seriously, it would mean a lot if you took the time to make sure you show your support, you know. July got off to a strong start. Since I took the time to focus my efforts on both Luigi's Mansion 2 Dark Moon HD and Monster Hunter Stories Remastered. If you're wondering why I decided to call it by that name, it's the best of both worlds. In America, it was known as Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon, but everywhere else, it's Luigi's Mansion 2. So I figured it'd be perfect I ref if I refer to it as such. So if you want to watch all 17 parts, there you go. I had a lot of fun playing it, and I hope one day to do the original. If only my new 3DS XL's cartridge slot can function properly instead of having me need to remove the cartridge repeatedly just for it to work. Heck, I tried it with my new 2DS XL, and I'm like, why? Why is this happening? If you want a spoiler, after I'm done with Dragon Quest VI, I'm doing the latent DS games. Yep, I'm doing it in preparation for the new world of Steam. As for Monster Hunter Stories Remastered, I'm making progress. Plenty of progress. I'm near the end of the journey, and I will say that it won't be a pretty one. There will be a post-game, but it'll mean I need to get my hands on some of the more strongest monsters in the game. The post-game won't play around. It's gonna play for keeps. Also, due to the humidity, I'm limiting my time on the HP Omen. Besides, I'm making progress. A lot of progress. I only hope it's more than enough for you guys. If things get a bit cooler, I may do more. All we can do is wait and see. Sure, the playthrough isn't doing very well, but hey, I don't care. If I can at least make one person happy with it, it's all that matters. I hope you all look forward to the rest of it. I haven't decided on what else I have, but I will say this. I will be doing more Switch-related stuff. Maybe I can change things up and add something different. Who knows? Who really knows, you know? You guys know I will be doing live streams, but that won't happen until I return from my vacation. Remember, on the 29th, that's when I leave, and you'll be seeing a video letting you know that there will not be any videos happening. I need a break. When I do come back, I'll be streaming Life is Strange, starting with Before the Storm. Look forward to it. Now, I know you guys may find this to be either tasteless or selfish, but I truthfully don't care, honestly. There's a reason why I'm doing this fundraiser, and if you see this photo here, you already know why. My HP Omen 15 from December of 2020 has now reached end of service, or rather end of support. Basically, there is the possibility that even if I get a post-warranty care pack, I may be unable to get this thing repaired. It's like this with HP products. Technology continues to evolve, to push itself further. But as I write this, I feel as if what I do may not be enough. Hell, someone actually had the gall to say to me, get a job. This is my job. So yeah, I really don't want to resort to desperation, but if you want to help me reach my goal, please consider donating to the fundraiser I have. Links in the description. I want to continue on working. I have plans, and what I'm hoping to get done is part of it. I want to make sure that I can keep on doing what I love to do without the fear of my tech breaking down on me. Yeah, if it's a bit loud, I do apologize. It's because my mic is very close. If that happens, everything enters in with Sandstell. I can't record, edit, or render videos. Basically, everything stops. Then it's going to affect me long term. It's not the first time, and it will not be the last. Anyone that does contribute will get a shout out from me. You have my word. And if you're wondering, I'm putting my own money into it. Believe me, I'm hopefully getting paid this week, and when that happens, I'll be putting all of it towards saving up. At the rate it's going to take me, it's going to take me roughly two to three months, if things continue as they are. Which is why your help may speed things along. But I can't force this on you. I'm not DSP. Why? Because I'm not the kind of person that would take advantage of someone's generosity. 
I can't always rely on the same person over and over again. And if you know who I refer to, I refer to as my Fortnite brother in arms, my GTA compadre, my Overwatch brother. You get the idea. And yeah, that's it. This ain't much of an update. It's a quick one, but I need to get this up. If you enjoy this, please be sure to hit that like button. It means a lot. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and click that bell. I will see you then. This is Mega Man NJ signing off. Peace out.